Hey everyone, I'm Jared with ToneandTitan.com here at the gym at Station Park today. I wanted to run you guys through a quick three exercise circuit. It's kind of a total body workout, one of my favorites. It's quick, it's, oh I don't want to say it's easy, it's quick, the exercises are pretty simple to do, and it's just a great way to get in a total body workout if you don't have a whole lot of time, okay? So, the first exercise that we're going to do is called a thruster. We're going to use this barbell. Sometimes it's a little bit easier if those bars are actually on the rack already. But what you're going to do is you're going to get it right up at about chest level. And so starting position is about right here. This is a great exercise. I love it. It's going to combine a squat with a push press actually. So right here head up, shoulders back. I'm going to drop down as low as you can into the squat. You're going to explode back up and push the bar up over your head. Okay, so that counts as one rep. So at full speed, it's a little, little easier at full speed. Full speed, you're going to come down just like that. You're going to actually perform 10 of those, okay? So we're going to do 10 thrusters. Make sure the weight's appropriate that you kind of struggle a little bit by number 10. The next exercise we're going to jump on are some kettlebell swings. Again, a very similar motion, but uh, work things just a little bit differently. You're going to find your kettlebell. Feet are about shoulder width apart. Starting position is standing up straight, just like this. Come down into a squat. As you explode up out of that squat, the kettlebell open over your head. Okay. When you come back down on this, don't let the kettlebell pull you forward. You got to keep your chest high, your shoulders back when you're doing it, okay? So at full speed from here, looks just like that. Again, the most common error that I see with a kettlebell swing is when people come down, they lose that straight lower back. They round forward like this. I want you to stay up nice and, straight and tall, really drive through those hips to get that kettlebell up and over your head. Um, 10 reps there. And then we're gonna immediately jump into our last exercise, some wall balls. What a wall ball looks like, you're gonna grab, a lot of gyms will have these big, kind of soft medicine balls. A lot of them won't, a lot of them will have the hard medicine balls. These ones work a little bit better. Either one of those works just fine, okay? What you're gonna do, get into this position right here. I want about a ball distance between me and the wall holding it right at chest level. Again, shoulders back, chest high. You're gonna come down into a squat. When you do your squat, make sure you go all the way down. Get your butt down below the level of your knees. So from there, you're gonna explode up and actually throw that ball as high as you can up against the wall. When it comes back down, you're gonna cradle it and come into a squat at the same time. So a wall ball looks just like this. Starting right here, down into the squat, up, and then, again, when you catch it, you're gonna cradle it into a squat. From here, up, up. So it looks just like that. You're gonna complete 10 reps of that, and then go back to your thrusters. Thrusters, kettlebell swings, wall ball, each one 10 times, complete that circuit three to four times. Try it out, one of my favorite quick workouts ton of muscles used, a great uh, total body workout, and uh, one of my favorites. Try it out.